All right, so I'm doing a video on how to break a bead. The previous one that I did, uh, I was using a plank, you know, two by six or whatever it was, and a wooden block to push the, the uh, bead down. So let me show you another way, actually, uh, an easy way, I think, where hopefully it'll be easier for you. Let's see, so you actually need three tire spoons. Well, I'm missing one, so I have to use the screwdriver, and this is this is a bad idea because you know screwdriver is sharp and it messes up your uh, you know it messes up stuff. But in this case, I'm I'm taking it off, so I really am not too concerned. So basically, what I'm doing is I'm just gonna use a spoon to kind of pry at each spot. So I'm gonna use I'm gonna hold one spot down with the other spoon. I'm just gonna work it. Oops. I'm just going to basically work it all the way around. this is that it kind of slides the tire inwards in towards the center of the rim a little bit at a time all right then eventually all of a sudden when you make it all the way around it just all of a sudden and you saw that it sort of just popped out so it, that's that's i was lucky on that case sometimes it doesn't pop down about when you make it all the way around is what you have to do is get the tire in say like a 12 o'clock position or 6 o'clock position, whatever, then go two hours later. So if you're in a 12 or a 6, go to a 2 or an 8, right? Hold the 2 down, and with your third you know, iron, preferably a tire iron, not a screwdriver, stick it in there. Instead of pushing it down like you do with the other two, you actually go in, go push it up, and that also pops it out. But you, know, that's, but you have to work, work the spoon all the way around first, then, then you can do that. And it usually pops off, so that's another way of doing it. So if, you know, if you're on the road or something like that, you know, on the road trip, three tire irons is all you need. The spoon type is my pre my preference, and that's the other easy way of uh, breaking a bead. Thank you.